Hello, Super Nerd friends, and welcome to the Red Wall of Lateness. Um, as you know, I only do these videos in this room when it's getting late, so that my parents aren't bothered by my talking to the camera. So, yeah, that's, that's where we're at. Um, anyway, <laughs> uh, I don't have much to say today. It's a bit late, um, because I spent the day with my mom, um, and my sister, we went shopping and then we went to lunch and it was really nice um and then i helped linda deliver some more magazines which was kind of horrible because it's very hot but it was nice to see linda um yeah i have a bit of news about my car uh it is toast <laughs> pretty much uh the uh engine is not functioning properly and will not function properly and there's no easy way to fix it so we're getting a new engine for it yay um, my dad went and talked to the guys at the used car lot and they said too bad basically like they weren't gonna do anything about it um so my dad wrote a letter to our like local attorney general person and he is talking to a lawyer because it's against the law for them to sell you a car that is going to break on you after a month and not to compensate you anything for it. So that's fun. Um, my dad's getting a new engine put in that he just bought the other day um, that has about 40,000 miles on it, so it's fairly new <laughs> comparatively to my 99,000 mile engine that is currently in my neon. Um, so yeah, it should be drivable apparently by Friday, which is exciting. Um, and then I will be headed to uh, Pullman on Monday, next Monday, um, to do my stuff. And in a couple weeks I'm going to be in Las Vegas. It's kind of insane, um, but really exciting. I'm super excited for it. I really just want to get out. Um, driving to Seattle was really nice. The drive there, not so much the drive back. <laughs> well, and the the pause between cars on the drive there wasn't really that much fun either. Um, but it was nice to just drive for a while. I don't know, there's something really soothing about just driving and not having anything else to do for the day but drive. Um, Besides that, uh, I told Becky that I've been writing a lot, uh, or I've been trying to write more. Um, just to get my thoughts down on paper is nice. Um, I just have this inner urge, like I really, really want to not necessarily become a novelist, but I want to write novels, I guess. And I don't know why that urge is even there, but I feel like it's something I need to do. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I have like five or six different ideas, some of which kind of sound the same, so they might become less ideas. Um, some of which I might stretch to more, so you know, yeah, whatever. But yeah, so maybe I can send you guys some writing some time to read or edit or something. Um, I don't know how that works with our no textual communication, but you know, it'd be, it'd be nice to get feedback. Um, even though I have nothing planned yet. Hmm, besides that, um, Becky, I think your fanfiction sounds fun, um, and I do want to read it like I told you. I don't know the technical terms of fanfiction, I've never been a big fan of it, um, but I think it sounds like a fun thing to do, um, and a nice way to kind of introduce yourself to the world of creative writing since it is very difficult often to think of your own stories and it is fun to use other people's characters because a lot of people have well-developed characters that you want to see in different situations and I completely understand that. Uh, that was one of the things that comic book fans noted about the Avengers that people really liked was that it very much took you into the area of um, who would win a battle, this hero or this hero, you know, Iron Man or Thor, or Captain America or Iron Man, or you know, Loki or Captain America, and, you know, just tons of combinations, Hulk and Black Widow and ev just everything. Um, so, yeah, it's, that's one thing that people, especially with comic books, really like to see. 
um, explored that well. So I definitely believe that fanfiction can be a valid form of writing, obviously. I don't know how many people would argue against it, but yeah, I, I'm excited for that and I would like to read it despite not knowing Supernatural the best. I did watch a couple seasons, but I don't. I think I stopped actually the episode that you are talking about. <laughs> so that's fun. But yeah. Yay, excited for future reading thingies. Uh, Haley, I hope that you get figured out what you want to do. I think it would be fantastically fun for you to go be a bassoon player in uh, Anchorage, was it? I don't remember. <laughs> um, but, you know, get to have some time away, get to get back to your musical roots, hang out with your best friend. That sounds wonderful to me. Um, but, you know, just, just keep your options open. That You can always get new plans and that things change. Um, I, I think dares would be fun. I just am also very bad at them. Um, like, even when I'm with people in the same room, we're trying to, like, what's my truth or dare? I'm just terrible at thinking of tears. Um, but hopefully you can think of something and just have some fun. Um, and, and I'd like them obviously to be on the vlogs because it'll make it more fun. But, you know, we, we can make them vlog centric or we can make them extra things to do in your vlog or whatever, you know, just, just so we're challenging each other. Uh, I feel like we've grown a bit stagnant. Um, and I would like to bust out of the box that we've put ourselves in, um, and just, I don't know, experiment with video and what there is out there to do. Um, I don't have much else to say, it's actually going to be kind of a short video. <laughs> um, and yeah, I really have nothing to say. I kind of put this off till really late, hoping that I would think of something, and I didn't. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm gonna go. Uh, I love you guys, and I can't wait for your videos. I love watching them, even though by the time I get to mine, I forget everything that happened and everything you said. Um, so I'm sorry about that, that I don't address things you talk about more often. I feel like we need to be more interactive and more focused. Um, but yeah, I love you guys, and I will see you later. Bye.